The Oregon Liquor Control Commission has created the Go Legal Public Awareness Campaign to help Oregonians better understand our state's legal marijuana market. The Go Legal Campaign underscores the importance of marijuana consumers and the industry choosing to participate in the regulated market, while working together to eliminate the illegal market and its criminal activity. Producers plant, cultivate, grow, harvest, and dry marijuana. Here, we introduce some of our licensees and learn how being a part of OLCC's regulated market has impacted their business. We focus a lot of our energy on, on trying to make sure that our, our plants are grown as naturally as they can, being a part of the newest and best and brightest, making sure that our growers have the right information to be successful, making sure that every time our plants go to market, they've been treated with, the, with the, the best love and kindness that we can give them. What cannabis has done for the state of Oregon in terms of bringing job opportunities has been tremendous. We've hired a couple of people in the last year and we're looking at hiring probably another 10 to 14 people in the next year, giving people opportunities that never existed before. Without this industry, uh, you know, there's 10 or 12,000 people that wouldn't be employed in the state of Oregon right now. We are committed to paying a living wage here and health benefits, and I think that people are really starting to see this industry, this regulated industry, as a boon for education and knowledge and breaking that stigma that has been long pervasive in this industry. Folks that have been working for decades in the cannabis industry now have a level of protection that they didn't before. Oregon has a long history of supporting small companies and helping them re retain their, their flavor, if you will. Yeah, their identity. And I feel this has been reflected in the uh, OLCC's approach to uh, regulation of, of uh, upstart cannabis companies. Oregonians are revolutionary. It's one of the reasons we moved here 25 years ago. We like the fact that cottage industries were respected People could do things from their own property and make things or grow something and, and have it be accepted. Oregon is doing a great job of rolling out the industry. Uh, one of the aspects that I appreciate is the rigorous pesticide testing. I think that that's gonna set uh, Oregon apart as the cannabis industry develops nationwide. Um, Oregon is going to develop a reputation for purity and integrity because of our rigorous pesticide testing. Exactly like why we want to eat organic and grow organic and have an organic orchard here and grow our own foods and work with locals here. The same reason we want people to be doing it with cannabis and I think it's, it, it's, it's, a, it's something that people can understand. Seed to sale is one of the best things to happen to the cannabis industry because it allows you to track where your plants came from. These great little blue plant tags right here, that tracks the plant all the way from when it was a seed that was propagated, and that goes all the way through to the bud on the shelf or the oil that was produced by it or the edible that was produced by it. That increases the level of transparency and accountability of growers to know that it all comes back to the soil, to, to where the plant came from and who grew it with what practices. In 10 years, I see the Oregon cannabis industry uh, being a nationwide leader. Cannabis may be Oregon's number one cash crop, and I certainly believe that it's going to be uh, one of the largest economic sectors in Oregon in 10 years. Mm -hmm.